So this is going to be a very long video. We're going to be making a speedo from beginning to end. So, I like the colors on this car. We're going to slap them on this Vagrant. And the reason we're using the Vagrant is because of its delivery list. If you're trying to make an Avenger, you're going to want to use a Vagrant. So the blue tartan is going to give us a galaxy wrap on our Avenger if we make one. So the first thing we're going to do is the arena yacht merge. For that you're going to need a friend, a yacht, a vehicle you're merging from, basically the uh, car you're pulling colors from, as well as the donor vehicle which is our Vagrant. All in all, for this glitch, you are going to need a nightclub, a casino, facility, MLC. It's a lot, guys. Sorry if I'm forgetting stuff, but you'll see as we go along. So then, we'll be receiving our uh, modded Speedo into the personal vehicle storage of the MLC. Links for how to move your speed all around, what you can do with it, like what you can merge to, like your Avenger, Acid Lab Delivery Bike, how to teleport, all those links will be in the description. So we're going to go ahead and take our donor car. Drive it outside just so that's the last vehicle we use. You're gonna go ahead and make your way to the ticket booth at the arena. Again, you need to own a yacht as well as a helicopter like the Buzzard or the Sparrow for this. You're gonna have your friend start up a job, any job, doesn't matter. You can't see the ticket booth, go to your map lip options and make sure all your things are enabled. So hit right on the D-pad, wait on the screen, have your friend send you an invite to a game. I'm sorry, to a mission. Wait on the screen, tell your friend to leave the job. As soon as they see themselves on the ground, you're going to accept the alert. You will hear three booms. You're going to imagine the fourth and hit A on the fourth. When you come back, you should come back to no mini map, as well as stop jacking you into the job. That's how you know you hit it. Now have your friend invite you to the LS car meet. Once you get to the car meet, you and your friend both need to call out your vehicles. You need to call out the vehicle that you're pulling the vehicle mods from, like the colors, the rims, whatever you're using. Most people go for colors, rims, and tanks. As soon as you both have vehicles in, you'll be able to start the sprint. Sorry, I'm assuming you guys know how to do this, so it's going to be doing a sprint. As long as you follow the video, you will end up with the finished product. So. Oh. 
Now, as soon as the race starts, you're going to want to register as a CEO president. If you're using the buzzard, if you're using the sparrows, you don't need to. Now, you're going to go ahead and make your way to the LS Custom. Before you go down into there, go ahead and call out your helicopter, whether you're using the Speedo, I'm sorry, the Buzzard, or the uh, Sparrow. Either will work, go ahead and make sure it spawns in. Now you're going to drive into the mechanic, and you can either hold Y straight away, or you can today? wait till the menu loads, hit B, and then hold Y basically back button and then respawn. Now you're going to end up on a permanent black screen. You need to join somebody in a different targeting mode than you. After you join, you're going to accept the first alert, deny the second, accept the third. Run to your helicopter. Now you're going to try to fly away. The first time it's going to slingshot you back to where you started. The second time it will let you fly away, so be prepared for that. Just keep watching and see what I'm talking about. That slingshot. Now at this point, go ahead and make your way to your yacht. Once you get to the yacht, go ahead and call your captain. Brendan here. You should be able to captain request your personal vehicle. You're going to request the Vagrant. Or whatever vehicle you'd like to pull mods from, but it'd be pretty pointless to uh, do this I'll marriage. I'll get that sorted right away. Should be waiting on shore. Use an delivery. So most likely you're using a Vagrant. So if we fly over right now, you'll see that the Vagrant isn't modded yet. At this point, the only thing you gotta do is hold Y to respawn. Once you respawn, your Vagrant is modded. If your friend can quit the job, go ahead and have them quit it. If not, you should be able to quit it. All you gotta do is bring up your map and start any job, and then leave the job and you'll be able to go back to the vehicle and it will still be modded. Let's go ahead and back out as soon as you can. to save this vagrant, G'day, boss. which means we need to modify one thing on it. That's just in the way. So we're just going to take it to the uh, LS mechanic right here. Fly it through over here. We really only need to change one thing. We're going to go for the livery.
Ah, I'm stuck with headlights. Again, that blue tartan will give us the galaxy rat. No, at this point, go ahead and leave that vehicle there. Save. We need to push this vehicle into our speedo slot. So you and your friend need to go ahead and make your way to the uh, casino. This next glitch, you're going to need the casino, you're going to need a nightclub, and you're going to need an arena with a full floor. Which is what we started with. That's where our vagrant and our donor vehicle was. At a completely full floor. So you need to call out a vehicle. It can be any vehicle. It doesn't matter. It just needs to be one that you own. Okay. It can't be any vehicle. It can't be the vehicle need, you're moving Some wheels? around. I can bring them around. It's on the way. Yeah. There's our friend. Go ahead, grab your car. Go ahead and grab your friend. And make your way to the tent, or not the penthouse garage. You need to make your way to the parking garage. Once you're in there, tell your friend to get back in the car, and they need to stay in the car until you tell them to get out. Now you need to teleport to the nightclub. That's to be teleporting at some point. You could drive to the nightclub, but after that, the next step, you're going to have to teleport. So you might as well just learn how to teleport now. Link will be in the description. Go ahead and make your way to your B1 garage where your Speedo, Meal, and Pounder are. doesn't matter. You're gonna hit right on the D-pad and you will freeze. You'll be able to do anything. You undo it. You bring up the GTA menu, close it, tap wide, get out of the car, and now you're gonna teleport to the arena. This is where you have to teleport. You will not be able to walk out of the nightclub. your way through that full arena floor with the donor vehicle which is our vagrant. Go ahead and hop in the donor vehicle. Get right on the d-pad. Back out, exit the arena. Now at this point you're going to call your speedo and then you're going to count to eight. So one, two, Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Tell our friend to get out of the car. If you look closely, you'll see the plate change. Now bring it back into that same full garage. At this point, we are driving our Speedo. The game doesn't know it. Go ahead and place it over the Vagrant. Now the Vagrant is in the Speedo slot, and the Speedo is in our Vagrant slot. I already have a copy of that speedo, so I don't really need it. We're going to delete it here in a second. Just to show you, there's a speedo. Just going to buy a free car over it. Or you could uh, drive an NPC car over it. Doesn't really matter. It's pretty easy to get rid of. It's a one on one, and you would like to keep it. Call a car from your nightclub, drive it in, place it over, they'll swap spots. 
Let's go ahead and make our way to your nightclub at this point. We are now ready to make our mod speedo. At least I thought. <laughs> so in order to make the modded speedo, you need to have nightclub goods. If you do not have nightclub goods, you cannot do the nightclub cell missions. Which is what you need in order to make the speedo. Mine was not ready yet, as you are about to see. show you there's our uh, donor vehicle our vagrant so at this point register as a CEO or MC president make your way to the computer and again you need to have uh, nightclub goods okay have welcome zero, to club zero dollars to sell age. In my so day, I need this to accrue some stock before I can make my speed up. Be back with you when we're able to. Thank you, Dada, for taking the joy out of life. If you've got half a brain, you'll know what's happening just by walking around the place. But this home screen will show you the club's popularity and the warehouse's stock in night. Alright, so it's been a little bit of time. Back in the game. Vagrant's still set up, ready to go. See, we have $27,000 to sell. You don't need much, guys. Just enough to make the sell mission. One of 36. So great. So we're going to go to sell goods. If you have a uh, full nightclub and you don't want to sell everything, you can actually uh, go up here and click on the individual thing and just sell that. But now at this point, the Speedo is made, but it is not saved. Okay. We need to drive this speedo to the give cars to friends location from MLC to MLC. It's the only way to receive this thing. And then from there, our friend will babysit it. They will literally stay with it the entire time until we receive oh my God. it. This will be secure at some point if they do not watch it. Be back with you when we're over there.
Alright, we are at the location. I'm gonna go ahead and give this fan to our friend. They need to be directly in front of you staring at this fan the entire time. The moment you leave the game, and we're leaving the game, you're gonna have your friend break into the van. They're going to sit in the van the entire time until we are ready to receive it. So we're gonna go to Rockstar Creator. At this point, our friend is trying to break into the van. Keep trying to break into the van. As soon as they get into the van, they are going to stay in the van. And not get out of the van until you are ready to receive it. Because at this point, nobody owns it, and it will despawn if he looks away from it. And that's why he's just going to continue to sit in it the entire time. So he invites us back, join back in. Probably should have set my spawn location to the last location. I'm gonna go ahead and make our way outside so we can teleport. And actually, just to show you real quick, we still have that vagrant in our V1. You'd like to save the vagrant? You should do so. Move it to a different garage. You have an empty spot. Video on for how to fix the uh, dead slot speedo will be in the description as well. Our friend is currently still babysitting that modded speedo, so we need to hurry up. Alright, go ahead and teleport over to the Sandy Shores location. You can see he is still in that speedo. We're actually going to teleport to the airport so that we can grab our MOC. His MOC was already in the spawn location at Sandy Shores. I'm not trying to make it too confusing, but basically just teleporting here so I can grab the MOC. That's all. Now go ahead and grab your MLC, take it to the location where the rusty car is. There's also individual videos for each of these pictures. The Arena Yacht Merge, the MLC to MLC. The cars the fans glitch, as well as the glitch to push vehicles around. So I'll go ahead and line it up like I do. You want the rear tires of the trailer where the rusty car should be. You want the left side of the trailer lined up with the gutter. Actually a whole parking spot off. You need to go ahead and count the spots. But the tires just need to be where that rusty car spawned. The one with all the garbage in it. And the left side of the trailer needs to be lined up with the gutter. Need the further instruction, just watch the video in the description on how to do it. It's the MOC to MOC glitch. So at this point you need to have a helicopter, whether it's the well you don't need to, but it's preferred, it's faster. And you need to call the buzzer or the sparrow. And go ahead, oh you also need a personal vehicle in the back of your MOC, you don't care about. 
We already have that duster safe, so we're gonna go ahead and just buy a blazer or something. Cheap, easy. This next glitch, you do need the penthouse as well as the bookmark job in the description. And your graphics mode needs to be set to fidelity. If it's not on fidelity, it will not work. The fidelity part is for next gen only. Now. Once you're in your penthouse, you need to join somebody in a different targeting mode. The reason my job is white is because I'm the one that created it. You guys just will be yellow. We're going to join our friend in a different targeting mode, set the first alert, deny the second, walk up to the crack in the door. You want to be able to see the option to hit right on the D-pad. So for next gen, music locker, hit A once, spam right on the D-pad. For old gen, I'm not really sure, I want to say you click casino and then spam right on the D-pad. But what you want to do is fall through the floor. Normally you would fly back at this point if your friend was babysitting the vehicle that was in the MOC, but they're babysitting the Speedo so that we don't lose it. So we have to drive back.
Alright, so once you get back to the trailer, the goal is to have the rusty car in the rear wheels, have the trailer not popped up. If it pops up, you need to drive away, try again. So you're going to slowly edge your way up to it until you lightly tap it. It jumps into the air, the trailer will jump up into the air. And once it jumps into the air, you hit around the D-pad one time. So drive up slow, lightly touch it. The moment it jumps up, you hit right on the D-pad one time. If you get sucked in to the MLC, you're going to have to go re-glitch out of the casino. If nothing happens, that means the blue circle wasn't there. And what you want, like what's going to happen in the video, you're going to drive up, slowly touch it, hit right on the D-pad one time, it'll slam down, and you won't be sucked in, and you won't be able to drive away. If you need further confirmation that you hit the glitch, your friends can come over and see if you're invisible. If they can see you, you did not hit the glitch, and you need to try again. So, super close now, barely edging it. I'm telling you, the slower you can edge it, the better. I touched it, hit right on the D-pad one time. That is exactly what you want. Trailer slams down, and you did not get sucked in. So now our friend is going to bring us the Speedo. We're going to hop in the Speedo. And they're going to send us an MOC invite. Now you can either just straight accept this MOC invite, and you'll end up on a black screen, and you just kill your game from there, and it'll be accepted and received. Or, you can do like I do, where when they send me an invite, I'm going to bring it up on my phone. And as soon as the, the invite's up on my phone all the way, I'm going to hold the menu button, release menu, and accept the invite almost at the same time, but you're releasing menu slightly before. So release menu, and then accept the invite. You should end up on the black screen, but with your GTA menu. And then you can just click to Rockstar Creator instead of killing your whole game. So we brought the phone up, invite up, held menu, we hit that part. Now we're going to go to Rockstar Creator and have our friend invite us directly back. We're not quite done yet. It is saved into the back of our MLC, but we still need to move the Speedo to our uh, nightclub where we can actually do something with it. It needs to be stored in your B2, 3, or 4 of your nightclub. Wait on our friend to invite us back. So as soon as you spawn in, you're going to want to make your way to your nightclub. Or if you just have faith and trust, you can uh, just call out your MLC and call the vehicle from your nightclub. But either way. We're going to go grab a car from our nightclub force that we do not care about. That way it's ready for our uh, next MLC. The MLC good price to print switch. Again, you don't have to be at your nightclub. You can just call a vehicle from your nightclub and drive it into the back of your MLC. So my nightclub was my spawn location already. Go ahead and get the car that you don't care about. As you can see, I have a bunch of cars I don't care about. We're going to take this bike and swap spots with the Speedo that's in the back of our MLC. Call the MLC. And drive up to the back of the trailer and accept the alert. Pad, hit A. And now just to show you, 
I'm gonna drive back to the nightclub real quick. Speedo. You can merge the Speedo to uh, a couple different things. You can merge it to your Avenger, Acid Lab, RC Tank. Uh, links for all this will be in the description again. Just check out the description, guys. There'll be a lot of links. And there's our Vagrant still. If you'd like to save this Vagrant again, just take it to a free empty slot, a different garage, whatever you want to do, yada yada yada. That's going to be it for this video. Thank you guys. Have a good one.